Hello, each and everyone. Today I will show you the practical demonstration as well as the work working principle of the magnetic elevation train that you might have seen in Japan. How that works. This is the practical setup. I will show you on this how that magnetic elevation train actually works. Now I will show you the practical demonstration of this magnetic elevation setup. I will switch this on. As you can see here, the material, the object. This object comprises of two disc magnets, M1 and M2 fixed on the two ends that's out in the upward direction and uh, as in the uh, downward direction m1 is used for providing upward force to pull this object as uh, electromagnetic material is in the upward direction that is placed here uh, if i will induce the current in the electromagnetic uh, magnetic material this object will be pulled in the upward direction due to the electromagnetic material property also uh, we have in m2 is used for generating the necessary position information so the hall sensor fixed on the base that hall sensor is fixed in the base so that uh, keeps the position of this object in, in standstill position whatever position we want i will show you now if i will increase the uh, current how this object will get attracted in the upward or in the downward direction as you can see now if i will increase the current you will see here on the object how this object uh, uh, will try to go in the upward direction as you know uh, this current is gets induced in the electromagnetic that is in the upward direction look that electromagnetic force is trying to attract this object in the upward direction. You can see this has become oscillatory, more and more oscillatory. I am increasing the current, I am increasing the current. You can see this object is trying to go in the upward direction. As I will increase the more and more current, this object will try to go in the upward direction and get attracted in the upward direction. You can see this object. Now I will try to decrease the current. You can see I am decreasing the current. You can see this system is going. Now, due to the gravitational force, this has gone in the downward direction. Now, uh, I will try to uh, balance this object in the center. So, uh, for that, I need a controller. I will insert the controller, you can see here. And now, I will increase the current. You can see, this is uh, again oscillating. Now, I will try to stabilize this. For that, I will uh, increase the gain. You can see, it's trying to get balanced. Still oscillatory. You can see now this is trying to stabilize. Look, trying to stabilize this. Trying to stabilize this. Look, now the system has become stable. You can see and this is in the balanced position and it is in the stable position. Thank you very much.